In a December 9 Twitter thread, Binance CEO Changpeng CZ Zhao blasted celebrity investor Kevin O'Leary for continuing to back disgraced FTX founder Sam Bankman Fried. The $15 million FTX paid to O'Leary, according to CZ, caused him to align with a fraudster and change his view regarding cryptocurrencies. Today's video is on CZ alleges FTX's $15 million made Kevin O'Leary align with fraudster. At Finance Doc, we will be sharing more explanation videos related to cryptocurrencies, trading, forex, and many more. So, watch this video till the end and hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get notifications for our future videos. So, let's begin the video. The Shark Tank judge defended some of SBF's activities in a December 8 CNBC Squawk Box interview. O'Leary claimed that the CZ-led exchange's opaque ownership structure prevented the CZ-led exchange from applying for licenses, thus FTX had to spend a lot of money to buy back its shares from Binance. CZ says SBF was unhinged. SBF was unhinged, according to CZ's tweet, when Binance opted to sell its FTX stake. The FTX creator allegedly launched a series of inflammatory tirades at numerous Binance team members and threatened to go extreme lengths to exact revenge, according to him. CZ further emphasized that SBF made significant media and public relations investments to disparage his competitors in the sector. CZ said, my ethnicity was a focus of those attacks. I'm Canadian, and Binance is not a Chinese company. After Binance's exit, FTX invested $5.5 billion. CZ said in a tweet that $5.5 billion had been invested by the bankrupt exchange after Binance withdrew its ownership of FTX in July 2021. CZ claims that FTX spent millions on political donations, Super Bowl commercials, baseball officials, Miami Stadium, and other things. Additionally, the CEO of Binance denied reports that Binance's association with the insolvent exchange FTX prevented them from obtaining licenses. More registrations and licenses have been obtained by Binance than by any other exchange including FTX, according to CZ. Since the collapse of FTX, Kevin O'Leary has defended SBF numerous times. O'Leary had previously referred to the failed founder as a genius trader and stated he would invest in him once more. He disclosed that he lost $15 million as a result of the FTX meltdown in his squawk box appearance. The $15 million is the whole amount of the contract O'Leary signed to serve as the spokesperson for FTX last year. In his defense for SBF, O'Leary said, If you want to say he's guilty before he's tried, I just don't understand it. There's only the murder of my money in this case. What is your take on the entire scenario? Share your thoughts in the comment section below to let us know. See you in the next video, until then take care and stay fit in health and wealth. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss out on our upcoming videos.